Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be making bacalaito, aka codfish fritters. And these are the ingredients that I will be using. So in this bowl, I have three cups of white all-purpose flour. I'm going to be using some sofrito, the codfish, which is bacalao, some black pepper, some garlic powder, parsley flakes, one pack of sazon, and a little bit of adobo. So let's get started. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take the pack of codfish, I'm going to open it, put it in the pot, and rinse it one time. So now that I rinsed the bacalao, aka codfish, I'm going to come and turn on my heat to high to medium, in between high and medium. And I'm going to let it boil. Okay, so this has been boiling for 20 minutes. So now I'm going to rinse out the water and I'm going to refill it and put it to boil one more time for another 15 minutes. Okay, so now that it's been boiling for the second time, I'm going to turn off the flames. I'm going to rinse this with cool water. So now that I rinsed out the water, I'm just going to break it up a little bit so it can be in little pieces and then we're going to come and we're going to put it to the side. Okay, so now that it's broken up in pieces, I'm going to come and put this to the side and we're going to get started with the rest of the ingredients. Okay, so now we're going to season this up. So here I have a half a teaspoon of black pepper. I have a teaspoon of adobo, a teaspoon of garlic powder, a teaspoon of parsley, and then here I have a tablespoon of sofrito. So I'm going to come and I'm going to add my sofrito. And I'm going to add the dry ingredients. And then I'm going to come and I'm going to mix it up a little bit. Once it's mixed, I'm going to add a half a cup of water. Then I'm going to mix it. Then I'm going to add the other cup, half a cup of water, which makes a whole cup, and mix that. Then I'm going to come and add another half a cup of water. It's going to be a total of two cups. And we're going to mix that in. So once you have mixed that, you're going to add your last, last half cup of water. And give that a mix. You're going to keep mixing it so you don't any lumps so once you mix this really well you're gonna come with your pack of sazon and we're gonna add that to the mix that's what gives it the color So now I'm going to come with my codfish, my bacalao, and I'm going to add it to the mix as well. And then we're going to mix that. I'm not going to mix it with the whisk. I'm just going to take a spoon and mix it up. Mix it all up together. And then once you have it well mixed, you can come 
and you can add it to the oil. So my pan has been on. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna test it. And the best way to test it is you come with the same spoon and you just let a, bit, a little bit drip. And once you see that it's sizzling like that, you know it's ready. Okay, so what I usually do is I take a ice cream scoop and I come and I scoop it up and I pour it in because I don't like them real big. I like them nice and small. But everybody's different. It's the way you want to do it. And then I'll come and I'll just add it like that. So now that it's fine, I'm going to come with my fork and I'm just going to lift it, make sure it's not sticking, and then let it fry. So now I'm going to come and I'm going to pick it up and flip it over, just so it can cook evenly on both sides. So what I usually do is I cook it three to four minutes on each side. And so I see that it's turning like a brownish color. You don't want it to get burnt because it's not going to taste great, but you want it to be crispy. Okay, so these are ready to come out. What I usually do is take a scotch towel or a napkin and I come and I put it on the plate. So then when I put these on, it will absorb all the oils that this has. So this is how I make bacalaitos, aka codfish fritters. It is so delicious, nice and crispy. I want to thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions, please comment below. And thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.